from justright.in. Today we are going to learn basic functionality of Audacity. It's a sound editing software. It's a very simple software, but yet a lot more to do with that software. So let's see how to do basic functions like record, import, and edit a audio file in Audacity. You can download this uh, from online. It's a free open source software. It uh, spells like this A U D A C I T Y. You can download this from the link given here in this video. Okay, let's see the interface of Audacity. This is the Audacity interface. The first thing I am going to show is how to record and playback in Audacity. These are the basic tools. It's a pause button, play button, and this is a stop, and this is skip to start, and here is a record button. The same tools again available in transport menu option here. Okay, now we'll hit this record button, the red button. It starts recording. Whatever I am talking now, it's uh, going to record. I'll say pause. Before recording, make sure that uh, you have proper audio drivers and the needed audio drivers and devices, audio devices like mic or speakers are installed on your PC or laptop. Okay, and then you continue. So I hit the pause button, so it's pause now. If I release this pause button, it starts recording again. If I say stop, if I hit again record, it will take another track. If you want to record on the same track, what you have to do is just press the pause button and release it. Okay, now if I want to export this, if you save this file, it will save the project, entire Audacity project. You observe this, save project, save project, and these are the two options given here, export and export selection. You can export the entire file or you can, or you can select the part which you want to export and save file, export selection, and select the extension you want, mp3 or mp2 or a WAV file. For example, here I'll say mp3 and then I say test1 and save. You can give... Uh, some details here, artist name, track name, album title if you want. Otherwise, you can leave blank also. Hit OK and it will be saved. If you want that entire file to be saved, you can just select anywhere on this track and then file and export selection. That entire file will be saved. If you want only part of the file to be saved like this, the selection, then you have to file and then export selection you have to save. You can select audio by just dragging the mouse, left clicking and dragging the mouse or you can go to edit, select, select all. It will be entirely selected. Only to select some of the audio track, make sure that select tool in the upper left corner is selected. This is the selection tool. Always make sure that this is active. Then click and hold beginning of the selection you want to select. For example, from here I want then drag the cursor to the end of the selection you want. This is how you select a bit of it. If you want to select from your cursor to the beginning or end, click on the edit tab. Go to select and cursor to track end. Then it will be selected till end. Okay. Now how to import the file we will see. You hit file and then say import audio and then go to audio files on your computer and say open and this is the audio file i'll stop here we will learn more about uh, audacity and how to edit audio files in audacity in next lecture